So I moved over to my office and I've typed into my calculator the data. Maybe I'll try zooming in a tiny bit. That might work. So on the left-hand side, I've got um, L1 is ads. And L2, L2 is revenue like that. And so I'm going to go into stat, edit. No, I did that already. I'm going to go into stat, calc, one variable. I'm going to pick list one. Those are the X's. And so the average number of ads, so oh, that makes sense, 115.91. Okay, and then SX, 61.21. Then I go back to stat, I calc again, one variable, I'll pick list two, second two, those are the Y's. So those are the response variables, the revenue Go down to calculate, hit that. And now I get the Y bars, 16,980. And SY, 49,48. Like that. So far, so good. And then I'm going to go to stat, calc, go down to linear regression. I'm going to go to this one, A plus BX. I'm used to A plus BX, like that. So in this case, A is the intercept, B is the slope. Lots of times in the stats, you write the number first and the slope times X second. So we'll use that for now. Either one gives you the right slope and intercept. Here we go, hit that. I have to say it's list one for X, list two for Y, go down, go down, calculate. Okay, so A is 79.30. Uh, point, maybe I might give it some more places, three, five, and B is 78.0, make it like 0 0.08, like that. So when we drew it by hand, we got 80, so we didn't do such a bad job. This is supposed to be the best fitting line. Um, and then here's the R, 0.9658, say like that. All right, so that's all the calculator stuff that I ran off to do. And so I'm gonna take these values back into the learning glass and then we'll uh, continue on with what we were doing.